If you need to produce less than a thousand parts, what would you recommend between injection molding, urethane, or 3D printing? The, uh, the rule of thumb, and again, it's, it's, a, it's a hard question to answer because the part geometry has a lot to do with it. If you're needing, I've always said, you know, maybe 10 to 25, 3D printing to me has always been a great way of doing that. When you need in that, say, 50 to 100 parts, you know, cast urethane is actually a, a great way of doing that because, you know, those, those cast urethane or silicone molds can usually last between 50 parts, you know, 25 to 50, but silicone molds are, are, are easy. So usually to me, when you get, when you get above that hundred to maybe 200 range, that's typically where I've seen that the, the cost savings of injection mold helps, you know, the consistency, you're going to get a lot better consistency on, uh, on 200 parts than you would 200 3D printed parts or 200 urethane parts.